Hello guys, welcome back to another video and today I have uh, taken up a challenge upon myself and today I am going to take on all the chess.com engines and let's get to it. So here I have in front of me uh, the chess board and I am going to start off uh, by playing the level 1 beginner .com engine. Let's get started. This is big brain time. So I told you that this is a challenge video and I am going to play challenge. No, no help needed. So let's get to it. First move E4. Let's go. C5. Okay. The beginner bot uh, seems to know a lot of chess here. Yeah? He wants to play the Sicilian defense against me. The rating is 250 of this uh, engine. Okay, I'm going to play the Meroxy bind on this uh, against this engine. Let's see how this engine fares. Okay, if I play bishop e3, what is he going to do? h5. Okay, so now I think uh, he's making weird moves. h6, h5 is not at all needed. Okay, we'll go for castle. He is about to take knight into e4. Okay, so queen has come there. Trying to take on this square. I'll support the pawn. We'll play safe for now. And we'll see how this uh, engine fares. Okay, so now knight into e6, attacking the queen. Since this is a beginner bot, that is why it is uh, bot in the sense it is a beginner level engine. So it has blundered the queen, no problem. This is a fairly easy match. Obviously, it is easy because it, the rating of the engine is just 250. I was shocked uh, that it played the Sicilian defense against me, but now I, I can see it. Don't worry, we have epic games coming. I am going to even take on a 3200 rated Grandmaster level engine. So let's see if I, how much, how many moves I can survive against that engine. Knight of 6 is a checkmate. Okay. Uh, 3 stars. I got all the 3 stars. And now let me go and play a new game. And we now this time I am going to see, I am going to challenge the intermediate level 6 engine this is the second game ladies and gentlemen if you are excited smash like on this video and also subscribe to the channel it will give me moral support let's get to it challenge it is a challenge no help thousand rated now I, okay caro can defense some of you might not know that i play the caro can defense on the streams i like to play the caro can on stream okay we have played the exchange variation of the caro can here let's see how much this engine has got against me we'll play c3 now okay b6 okay so now i'll just go and pin here knight e5 again pin here queen d6 okay let us go ahead and pin this knight bishop g3 i'll play bishop g3 we'll we'll keep it simple we'll keep it safe and then we'll win I, anyway i can get this free piece any moment so okay why not we'll take the free piece <laughs> queen c6 check and now we'll take the free piece i have a piece up already within, within 13 moves and i think this is an easy game to win although i won't say much because this is just the thousand rated engine uh, it was kind of fair for me to win if i didn't win then it would have been a shame for me a6 okay we'll go there now rook c8 Knight, okay, so blended the rook again, fine, not a typical thousand rated play, but fine, we'll take it. G4, okay, we'll bring the rook here, trying to take the pawn, okay, we'll take the pawn. Okay, again, blended another piece, I don't know why blended so much, does not like material, apparently, knight into d5. What do I call it? Do I call it a bot or do I call it just a normal engine? Surprisingly, uh, the thousand rated engine performs a little bit worse, I would say, than the 650 engine. I don't know my opinion, just my opinion, nothing else. No, now I understand uh, the thing is that these are meant for practice, but I thought to take it on, on myself and take it as a challenge. Try to uh, to try and defeat these engines basically. Okay, so I have successfully defeated the thousand rated engine. Now we'll go on and play the next engine. Now this time we are in the big boy leagues. We are in the 1600 advanced chess.com engine 1800 is the rating this should be a tough competition for me because my chess.com rating is 1800 in blades so let's see challenge do i play challenge yes no 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 i should play an assisted game that's not a coward would say this is a challenge and i am up for the challenge no assistance nothing doing only using my big brain to win smash like if you're excited we'll play e4 i am getting white so that is nice e4 b6 okay owens defense guys yes, i have made a video on owens defense you can see here i'll uh, after this video ends or in the cards i will put it in and you can find the whole uh, complete e4 preparation playlist if you have a, have a look at the video you will easily be able to defeat Owens defense. I hope I can uh, do so now. I do recommend to watch the entire playlist because I have covered up all the major responses what black can play against the first move e4. So if you if you are prepared, if you have watched the entire playlist then I think you should be prepared to play very epic games uh, as white with first move e4. Okay take with the pawn not exchanging the pair bishops. Bishop a3 what is the idea of bishop a3? Bishop b2 maybe in the future. If I castle, then just castle. Bishop b2 okay b1 get out. 
Okay, I'll add a rabbit to be there. H4, interesting move. Bishop to F3, Queen to F3, attacking the A2. Knight C6, okay, it was kind of uh, expected. Bishop G5, attacking the Queen. Bishop to E7, this bot is interesting. Oh, just blend. I, I blundered a pawn. Oh my god. I blundered one pawn. Okay, he didn't take it. So that is nice. This is a challenge, boys and girls. And we are up for the challenge here. We are not some crybabies. We are here to win. And we are going to win. Much like if you are excited and I am getting you hyped up for the final Grandmaster battle. Who knows, I, I might as well uh, defeat a Grandmaster engine. Who knows, you never know. So here, what I am thinking is, if I take here, takes, queen takes, and if I give a check, uh, give a check, king comes to e7, then can I push or is it too much to ask for? Uh, yeah, I think it is too much to ask for. Let us keep it safe. One pawn up for now, we will play four. If he takes, I will take back with the f pawn. And now we can go for an attack because, what? Why, why, why? What is that move? If I just, uh, what is this? If I just take, he blundered a free piece. Did he just blunder a free piece? Or was it some sort of sacrifice? Okay, so indeed it was some sort of sacrifice. Oh my god. Mm. If I try to open up the king side, now this is coming up. I need to be careful about that. I am one piece up, but not a huge advantage as of now. Mm. Interesting. To see how uh, this goes. If I give a check, if you give a check, if you give a check. So many checks we can give. Let's play rook to a1, boys and girls. We will try and get to that square immediately. Hmm. Queen to f3, queen a checkmate right? Let's see if the bot can, okay, the bot can find out. Now if I just attack the rook again, it is a free rook, no? Take. What is this trickery going on? Am I getting fooled? Okay. So okay, that was the plan all along. Very nice. We should have to g6 I can take. Uh, it is a free pawn. Queen g5. Okay. Now it is getting interesting, boys. It's attacking those two pieces at the same time. Which one do I save? Which one do I leave? Hmm. If I go here, he can take. He can't take neither of them. If I go queen to h5. Brilliant C, brilliant C. Okay, queen to g3. Now if I take bishop to f7. I should be able to win this. I should be able to win this. Let's see. H7, boys. Come on. H8, queen. Or do I want to take a check queen? Okay, we'll take a check queen. Happily. Give a check. King has to move now. Okay, bishop check. Let's go, let's go. Okay, now queen at 7 check. King, now rook at 7. And now we have uh, got the queen and now we'll win very easily. So, advanced level chess engine of chess.com. I have managed to defeat boys and girls. Happy vibes. Queen g3, uh, sorry, queen b3. And then here. It is a simple checkmate now. Advanced level engine I have managed to defeat. And uh, so far, so good. Let's see what happens next. Next engine. Now we are in the really, we are in the big boy leagues. I'm going to challenge the expert level, level 17 engine. 2100 rated opponent against me. Let's see, my poor soul can uh, take this much or not. And I would sincerely encourage you guys to like and share this video. It will give me moral support. One like equals to one prayer. And let's get to it. E4, come on, expert engine. Show me what you got. E4, E5, okay, interesting. Knight F3, E5 play, Knight C6, Bishop C4, Bishop C5, I play Castle, Knight F6. Now I am tempted to play a Gambit actually. Do I, do I uh, risk uh, playing the Gambit, playing the D4, uh, playing a Pawn Gambit, a small Pawn Gambit, or do I play the normal C3, D3? Hmm. Tell me uh, what I should play in the comment section below in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, thank you so much for <laughs> typing the comments, but I am going to play the Gambit, let's see. Okay, Bishop takes, Knight takes, Knight takes, if I play F4, trying to attack the E5 pawn, going to E7, okay, interesting. Mm -hmm. Now what is this? If I play knight c3, knight to one d5, he'll just play c6. No, I assume. Okay, no c6. Okay. What is happening? If I take, and now, okay, and now if I go bishop to f4, attacking the queen, queen c5. Oh my god, interesting. Am I about to lose very badly? This, uh, I think I'm about to lose very badly in this game. Not sure. Because terrific, terrific. Let's see. I played a gambit, but I don't think it is working out so well. It is working out too well. Let's see. Okay, fine. So I am getting this pawn. Uh, this pawn basically. Bishop to f6, I am getting back the uh, pawn. But do I want to take it now? That is the question. Hmm, 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 tempting, tempting offer, but do I want to take it? Let me use my big brain to calculate, should I take it or not? Hmm. If I take bishop takes, pawn takes, and then if I take it to the rook, then next there is nothing to follow up with, you know? Or shall I just go for it? Let's go boys, let's go. Equal material now, very nice. Can give a check, but I'll just move my king. So now I can play queen f3, bishop d7, if I play rook f1, trying to attack the e7, uh, sorry f7 square. Okay, okay, okay. b3, kick the queen away. Queen c5, okay, interesting. Now what can I do, what can I do, what can I do? Okay, queen c5 is a check, no question. I have to move the king now, obviously I have to move the king. I hope God is getting recorded today because I don't want the same disaster to happen again, man. It was the most horrifying experience of my life. I recorded the whole video yesterday and then the file was corrupted. My God. Okay, rook to c8. I think I'm having some chances here, boys. Some chances I think I'm having. I was expecting him to capture, actually. I was really expecting him to capture, but he didn't capture. He's planning to play c6, no? But he cannot play knight to f4 because this will be hanging. So what can I do in this position? Position, position, dangerous position. I want to, I, basically, the idea, what I'm thinking now, is I want to remove this bishop somehow. So that I can capitalize on that one. But here I can take this, takes, check, check. Check uh, king g7, but two pieces for the rook. I don't think it is too appetizing, no. But one more idea what I'm having here is that I take on c7, rook takes, and then I take rook into e6. f into e6, then this is going now. Uh, sorry, queen takes, this is going now. Tell me, tell me. Okay, this is not a live stream, I'm, I'm talking to a live stream. <laughs> I forgot. I streamed daily, by the way, 4 pm. Smash like subscribe for epic live stream. Knight into c7, if the rook takes, then I can take this, no. I don't see a problem with that move. Let's go knight into c7. Okay, now rook into e6. I'm a pawn up. I'm a pawn up against the expert engine. Okay, not a pawn up anymore. 
okay he's planning to take this one so what can i do if i take this pawn pawn for a pawn pawn for a pawn okay he's trying to take here now he's seriously trying to win if i take g3 uh, is it possible that i play g3 and somehow it's escape yes we play g3 why not rook g7 okay now, now we are getting to interesting interesting uh, points in this game hmm now if i play h4 uh, his queen will go back so that is not i want that is not what i want in this position so if i just bring my rook here if i bring my rook to d1 rook c1 give a check then the queen will capture no so not good rook at rook and rook c1 actually so i think it is better if i play check no no but if i play h4 queen to g3 then what will i do okay then i'll give a check and then take the queen so h4 seems about right i don't know if i'm opening too much here but we'll we'll go with it if i double the rook now supporting the material rook d8 check is coming up i don't know how he's prepared for that but uh I give a check. Wait, I don't want to hurry. I don't want to hurry because this is my only chance. Not only chance, I'll get multiple chances, but uh, I'm doing this first take, no? So that is why I'm a little bit scared. Little, little scared. Rook g8, and then if I give a check, he'll play f6, no? Just play f6. So then that is not good. Then I can play rook e7. I can play rook e7. Uh, is it am i risking too much am i risking too much let me calculate rook check he has to go back queen check he has to play f6 rook e7 he can give a check but then uh, this one's here so if i'm just moving give a check he'll move there and then queen can come here and give a check you know then i can play g4 though uh too risky too risky i don't want to take so many risks as of now but if i just play my rook to d7 what is, what is he going to play hmm, i'm curious to know he can play here and then try to come here no he can do that idea very interesting queen e6 queen s3 maybe so what can i do for that i just give a check check uh Am I risking too much or am I blabbering too much here? Yeah, I am taking a lot of time, but I do want to win this game, sincerely. Material is equal, however. There is no time control, so that is a plus point for me. I can think how much ever I want. Uh, what, what is this? What is this? I, I really want to give a check, but if I go there, and then I go rook b7, uh, then what happens? If I go rook b7 directly, that is not good, no? So what I am thinking is rook d8 check. Rook d8, imagine, imagine guys, you are big brain, I know. If you are subscribed, you are big brain. If not, then you can go ahead and become big brain. In just two seconds, by smashing the subscribe button. Uh, queen f3 check, uh, sorry, queen c3 check, and then if I, the pawn pushes, obviously, and then if I go here, Rook can or oh, Rook can give a check. Rook can give a check because my queen is here. So okay, so that is out of the window. That that idea is out. So now again, analyze. So this is what you need to do when you play against a high risk opponent. Analyze each and every position. Then only take a lot of risk because then don't go in for the high risk, high reward. Take risk, but uh, calculated risk, not blind risk. So what I'm thinking here is if I give a check and oh, sorry, if I give a check, Rook g8, Queen c3, f6, Rook. This comes here. Oh, then he can take here. And then if I take the queen, he'll give Rook d1 checkmate. He'll give Rook d1 checkmate. So that is again out of the window. Mm, I really want to win this game, boys. Mm -hmm. I can take a draw. I can take a draw. Let me show you how. Give a check. Rook comes back. Uh, queen c3 check. F uh, sorry. What am I doing? What is my life? Rook check. Rook goes to g8. Queen to c3 check. Obviously, he has to play the move f6. And then what I can do is, I can play queen here, no? I can play queen there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can do that, actually. But that variation I'll calculate again. What I will show you is a draw variation with check, rook g8, queen c3, f6, rook into g8, queen takes, queen check, king comes here, queen check again, king goes back, queen check, and then just take a draw. But I really want to win this game. So rook check, rook g8. Um, right. uh, then what I was thinking is queen c3 check, f6, queen c8. Then my rook is here, this rook is here. What can he do then? Or oh, then he can just capture, no? He can just capture. But then if I capture, uh, his king will come here, then if I give a check, I can win. I can win, boys. I have, I think I have uh, thought over this position for more than 5 to 7 minutes. Let's go, give a check. I hope everything works out. Queen c3, check. This is what we had planned. So now if I go queen to c8, I should be able to win. Oh my god, oh my god, oh shit, oh no, oh no, 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 king g1, queen g2, checkmate. I lost, after thinking for, after thinking for seven moves. Uh, seven minutes, sorry, I can win, boys. I, have, I think I have uh, thought over this position for more than five to seven minutes. I'm dumb, I'm dumb. I made zero mistakes and I made one blunder. Just made one blunder. Let us go here and have a look at the position actually. So here I thought check. Rook comes here. Queen c3 check. F6. Now I thought this variation. Okay. Rook takes. King takes. I should have taken a draw you know. I forgot that this little pawn over here was hanging. So I played queen c8 according to the plan. And he just took and delivered a checkmate. Oh man. Shit. Bad luck. Bad luck. Okay. 2100 engine, I was almost winning, but I lost. Expert engine, somehow I was almost defeating, but I lost due to my blood. Now we are in the really legendary leagues, legendary leagues, you can't even imagine. 2700 engine, grandmaster level. Let's go. But should I go with a friendly so that I can get three take backs? No, I think that is, that is what I should do. No, that's what a coward would say. This is a challenge boys, this is a challenge and I am here to take the challenge 
I am here to take on a 2700 rated Grandmaster. Please uh, pray for me. One like equals one prayer. I'm nervous. What opening should I play? I played E4 now. Sicilian defense. I am very sure that this Grandmaster knows all the opening variations. And I don't know any opening variations as compared to him. So what I will go with D4. Let's see how many moves can I survive. Now that is the question of uh, how many moves can Abhinav Bhatt, a chess beginner or intermediate level player, can survive against a Grandmaster level engine. My god. Now what is happening? I am already <laughs> out of my preparation. He can, oh my god. I'm, oh shit. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Bishop has come to e7. Okay. I play f3. Uh, so that not allowing right to g4. I'm trying hard. Really, I'm really trying in this game. So this way he can get some advantage. So do I want to keep allow him? No, absolutely not. Okay. Knight e7 now. Interesting. I play c4. So that controlling the center. Bishop e2. Knight h5. Is he going for knight to f4 or f5? Yeah, I think he's going for the f5 break, boys. I think he's really going for the f5 break. We'll castle. We'll see. We'll see. How many moves can I survive? Let's, okay. Bishop to g5. Interesting. Again. Very interesting. I play f4. Uh, I can play f4 actually. Knight will take, no? f4, knight takes. Oh, sorry. f4, knight takes. Bishop takes, bishop takes, takes, takes. Do I want to risk it? Yeah, we live only once. We try only once. Let's go for it, boys. Uh, if I take with the bishop, then it is forcing, no? Yeah, yeah. If I take with the knight, he can take back with the pawn, but if I take, 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 rook takes. I'm not so sure. Let's uh, take with the knight. Let's take with the knight. I hope I'm not blundering anything. It is all about survival now. Survival of the fittest. Knight to d5. See, this is an interesting move. Now, if I take here, and if I take the free piece, am I losing the game? Am I losing the game if I. Okay, should I take the pair bishop out or this thing out? Tough choice. Tough choice. Okay, we'll take on the pair bishop. Take the pair bishop out. Okay, bishop here, f3. Can I play bishop f3? Uh, yeah, we'll play bishop f3. He's an isolated point one. Okay. Come on. Blundered pawn against a grandmaster. This is not at all acceptable. Blundering everything. Literally everything I can see, I'm blundering. Oh, oh, oh. Am I not even going to make it in 20 moves or oh, what? Oh my god. Can I make it to the 20 move uh, mark? Rook d2, trying for an exchange sacrifice. Not allowing that at any cost. Okay. Queen c5 check. If I play king f1 only, I have to play no? only king f1 I can play. King h1, then he'll just finish me off. So now if I play there, I'm blundering. So that is out of the window. Oh, blunder. Uh, come on, man. Oh god, what is my life? Oh, blunder. Oh no. Now he'll just win, no? He'll just win. Now let me see how many moves I can survive. How many moves can uh, this little boy, little boy, survive? I'm small, cutie boy. He just wants to play little chess. Rooka, what can I do now? Okay, rook c4, why not? I don't see why not. I'm already losing, but 28 moves I have managed somehow. Uh, if I go into an game, then it is winning for him. Oh, c5 I cannot play. Okay, we'll play b4. B4, c5. Some ideas. Not even like that. Take, take, take. He'll just take to the queen, man. I'm, I'm low on material. I'm low on material. Please. Oh, God. Save me. Oh. Oh, play the 4 check I alert. No. Okay. Rook is coming here. C5. Now it is just miserable. Miserable. No, no, no. This won't have happened. Oh, God. Mm. What can I play? Queen d1. He just gives a check. Does not give anything else. What can I do? Give a check. I can, I can give one check. I managed to give one check, guys. How interesting. I managed to give one check. And now, what else can I manage to do? Lose this game, probably. No? Yeah, I'm losing this game. Very, very cool. Very cool. Interesting. Although I blundered, but okay. I blundered and I'm losing. But it is what it is. It is my fate. Okay. Give a check on d3. King comes here, rook check. Okay. I don't know why this rook check was checkmate in two moves. He missed checkmate in two moves. I don't know why. He missed checkmate in literally two moves. Queen b2 checkmate. But what you need to notice is man has 44 moves. 44 moves, I managed to go till the end game and I could have even played better if I didn't, uh, you know, blunder uh, pawns and blunder so many, so many material, so much material. Really, we are into it. 3200 maximum 25 level engine, chess.com engine. Let's see how much, how, how well I can fare against the maximum engine. 3200. No hints, no take backs, all natural, we are all in. E4, let's go. C5, okay, he's also played C5. Knight C3, Knight C6, F4, trying something new. I have not played this opening since two years. Not played, I've practiced, not played actually, but let's see. Dragon, Sicilian Dragon, grand free attack. I don't know how much preparation I, I still remember, and uh, but I'm really not sure. Okay, so if I play there, Knight comes here, I assume. Okay, Bishop G4. Hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm. Makes me angry. Hmm. Knight D2, am I supposed to play? I'm not sure. Yeah, we play Knight D2. Although I'm allowing him to break, oh man, I allowed him to break the center open. Oh, break open the center is what I meant to say. I allowed him to break open the center, which does not work in my favor at all. Mm, not good, not at all good. Take. Okay, fine. We will see. Against uh, the Grandmaster engine, I managed 44 moves, which was 2700 rated. With uh, 3200 rated, I don't know how much I can bear. First, I am taking it one, not allowing any checks. 94, okay. Am I losing already? Not sure. Okay, I could have taken. Why didn't I take, man? Why didn't I take uh, mental blind spot? I didn't take it. Oh, no. Okay, I can't take that also anyway. Oof, oof, 94. Sorry, 94. Eating moves in and I've given up one pawn. Very nice. So actually, we can't do anything. I'm a dumb. I'm so dumb. Oh, okay. I think I should be able to manage somehow. Mm -hmm. D4, I guess the idea next. Can I play D4? Will he allow me to play D4? Multiple questions. Which he, oh my god. 
Okay, man. What? Uh, I can't take the D4 pawn. Uh, absolutely. Christ. Taking this pawn as well. Oh, God. What can I do? Nothing. Nothing, boy. You can't do nothing. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what to play. Everything is hanging. Oh, my God. He will take. Yeah, I know. He will take. Uh, little G1. We will keep everything safe and sound. For now, at least. As long as I can, I will try to keep it safe. Okay. Keeping it safe. Blundering, losing terribly, which I'm not supposed to do. <laughs> oh man, okay, exchange, exchange, exchange. Thank you, thank you, thank you. He'll play d3. See, I know, I know he'll play d3. Ah, bishop d2, a5, okay, push. Get somewhere, take somewhere, get to some point. Mm. Oof, 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 oof. If I play there, I can increase some amount of moves, but do I want to? I really want to increase the number of moves. Oh man, can't push here, that is a plus point. Oh, I can't even take this. Great, 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 epic. Oh my god, how many moves? Can I survive? Five more moves. Can I survive five more moves? I don't know. Oh, I'm surely bound to get checkmated sooner or later. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Okay, we'll, we'll bait him. We'll bait him into taking multiple pieces. See, he does not even want to take the bait. Oh, God. What can I do? Just, okay, fine. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, one more extra. One more extra I managed to play. I <laughs> managed to play 45 moves against the Grandmaster. I, not, not, not the Grandmaster. The maximum level. Uh, engine so this was it for today's video i hope you enjoyed and i enjoyed playing against uh, these engines and i hope you like uh, like to watch uh, more interesting videos like this and if so smash the like button do tell me your thoughts about th these games and do tell me where all i blundered in the comment section below and uh, we are closing in at the 200 subscriber mark and as announced i am going to do a chess set giveaway as soon as i hit the uh, 200 subscriber mark so Stay subscribed and you might be the lucky one uh, to win a full brand new chess set. And this was it from my side. Thank you so much for watching and take care. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.